The following is a non-profit fan dub. The Adventure Zone is owned by the McElroys, Carrie Peach, and First Second Books. Links in the description to support the official Elite Spring Adventurers. <laughs> Guys, get in here! Aw, oh, hell, all right. Not me. You know they're just going to get slaughtered without you there to save their asses. Good point. All right, but I'm not running. I will mosey. Ooh, what a fantastic development! We have guests, my dear. How exciting! All right, that sounds good and weird. I'm coming! I haven't really worked out a catchy name for this place. Lair is a little on the nosy. HQ sounds a little corporate. Oh, let's go with last resting place. Fellas, look! It's Bogard! Okay, fuck this shit. I'm attacking this guy. Wait, wait, wait! Maybe there's a smarter way to go about this. Merle, your cousin looks like hell. You sure he's not dead? Yeah, he's pretty torn up, but he's still kicking. Him? If we attack, he'll kill the orc. You don't want that to happen, do you? I would like another look at that crossbow. Him! A third visitor! Wonderful! Darling, we need to prepare three more places at the table. My good man, I can't tell you how happy I am to meet someone else with proper diction. Ah, yes, you have the sound of a university man yourself. Where did you study magic? New Elfington. I'm not that familiar. It was built on the ruins of Old Elfington, which we burnt down because we couldn't figure out why it was called Old Elfington. Quid pro quo time, my handsome gent. Who might you be? <laughs> so I need to be introduced. My reputation precedes me. And here's my spiffy spider tablet. <laughs> Oh! You're the black spider! I hate to be that guy, but technically that's a white spider. So, black spider. That's actually just an alias, not my real name. Listen, Merle, I know how this works. If we figure out his name, he's banished. He's not Beetlejuice. It's Brian. Magic Brian. Now it is my turn to ask a question. How the fuck do you know about this magical mine of... Uh... Mine. Believe it or not, Craigslist? Well, I don't believe it. I believe you are here for the- N no Look, Brian. May I call you Bri? Bri-Bri, we're both magical dudes. Can you explain why occasionally when you talk in your truly mellifluous voice, I must add, we just hear static? Perhaps. The reason you can't hear when I say- just because and you're actually so you won't be able to understand this screw that noise I'm here for my cousin which cousin oh well I suppose it would have to be is the only surviving one his name is Bogart uh, of course of course Bogart goodness aren't you an angry little fellow you may most certainly take Bogart Take him and go. Excellent! Pleasure doing business with you. Oh! I do need one more thing. A tiny bit more of his blood. Let me at him! That's not going to work for us. Look, Brian. Bri Bri. We're gonna need to take Bogart with us. And the orc. In return, you get to keep the magical mystery mine. And your perfectly shaped head. Well, you silver tongue devil, you! I appreciate your somewhat backhanded compliment. Unfortunately, I find your solution unsatisfactory. I'm afraid this is where our pleasant chat ends. Oh, Schneiki. Gentlemen, welcome to Final Boss Territory! His name is also Brian, but it's Brian with a Y. Let's get it on! <laughs> it's about damn time. Whoa, Nelly, 
that's a new one from Taco. He cast fire mitts on the webbing. Perfect conical shape. That's Hall of Fame magic right there. What's your name, friend? It's Killian. Can we do the spider stuff now? Wow, okay. Sure, fine. Tell me about your dad. Is that what you want to do right now? I'm Magnus. The wizard is Taco. And the dwarf? Uh, Earl? Earl? Great. Now will one of you guys give me something good for squishing spiders? Try this. <laughs> Whip it! Whip it good! Oh, come on, you gotta let me have that one. Okay, Magnus. You can do this. Spiders are just big hairy turds with legs. Gross, gross, gross! Look what you have done to my good, good boy! You have completely ruined his aesthetic! Taco casts magic missiles. Outrays! Sorry, outrays. I'm trying to build my brand. I like it. Almost sounds French. Those look a bit like magic missiles? I'm not completely sure. Because this is how they look when I cast them! <laughs> Welcome to the wizard's door, Pally! Can't say I'm a fan. Taco! How's that fear of spiders treating you? I prefer the term non-proficiency with spiders. How's that not helping kill the monster thing treating you? He's right, Merle. You're up. What's it gonna be? What's your move? Uh, is there some kind of spell where you can pick up something heavy and throw it? Oh, I know where you're going with this. Not where I was going. Not where I was going. Oh, what the hell? We'll make it work. Cannonball! No! the It was one day from spider retirement. Did we win? You people have vexed me. I am so, so desperately sad. Hey, Magic Brian. Who? Huh? Africa, fuck you! It seems you have learned well from me. You took some pointers from my rad magic missiles. Uh, hello? Oh, were you waiting for me? I actually already said my one cool thing. It seems my goose might be... How do you say it? Cooked? So how do you like this? Oh shit! <sighs> Who didn't see that coming? Me. Okay. I see what he's trying to do here. I'm the real Bogard. I can tell you anything you want to know about myself, my clan, anything. You have to believe me. Oh, the fellow on the right is the imposter. I am the real Bogard Stone Seeker. Uh, wait! Maybe Magic Brian cursed Bogard to sound like he had a ridiculous accent. That is exactly what he did. That is a bad, bad boy with all kinds of sinister magicings. Finish him off and let's get on with our fun adventure. Oh no! You have solved my final riddle! You have proven yourselves to be quite the adventurers! You must be the clan, the Riddle Masters! Oh, oh, I've landed on Brian. He wasn't as soft as I would have imagined. He didn't really break my falls that much. I think I am doing the dying now. The life is flying from my body. Oh, I see my family!
My name is Merle, you fucking muppet! <laughs>